crayons, it's giving you a number. Your first number is 246. Yep, 246 should be the first number. You're going to use your crayons to draw in base 10 blocks to represent the number 246. Any color crayon you want. She gave us the start drawing it in your book. Okay, does everybody have their drawn for two points? Mm -hmm. That's fine. Okay, our next number is. 
hands are shown in the model on the board. This is on the board. Um, this one's not on the page that I had flipped to. Well, then, do you know how many tens are in the model shown? If we have 10 tens are in one 100. 40 tens. So we have 40. How many tens are in the model shown? If there's 10 tens and one 100, we have 10 tens plus 10 tens plus 10 tens plus 10 tens. So we can count by 10s, 10, 20, 30, 40. And the question is, how many 10s are in the model shown? There's 40 10s. And how do you know? You know that because you know there's 10 10s and one 100. So you have four 100s. hundreds, tens, and ones, and then write the number. How many hundreds do we have? Jay, how many hundreds do we have? Okay, we have, it's asking us how many hundreds. It has two here, but it's showing one, so it must be stacked up. We have two hundreds because two hundreds. How many ones? Quarter? Three. I'm sorry, how many tens? Uh, six. We have six tens. And how many ones, quarter? Uh, three. Three. So what is our number? Landon? Two hundred and sixty-three. Okay, same thing here. How many hundreds do we have? Chandler, we have five. Tell us we have five, and this is our hundreds block. How many tens? Isabella, one. One. This is a one. One ten. And how many ones? Kenley, Kenzie? We have eight ones. So this time we have eight, and that's a one block. So our number is 518. It's in the ones. 
the value of the one is in the one's place. work through the on my own just the front page by yourself and then we will check it and we will work over the next page with the problem solving together.